What's up guys, Intel has just announced a big rebrand for its lineup of processors with the new Core Ultra and Core naming schemes at the forefront. Whether the changes will make things easier for consumers is unclear. But here is all we know right now. Intel's new naming convention represents a big shift in how processors from the brand will be showcased, and it's not limited to the new Core Ultra chips. Intel Core branding will remain for mainstream chips and the branding will also be used for Intel graphics products too. Intel is yet to give a full explanation of the difference between the new Intel Core Ultra and Intel Core series chips and how they line up with previous generations, but for now, here is all we know about Core Ultra. Core Ultra is the new name for premium processors from Intel. The new lineup will start with Intel's Meteor Lake chips, which would have previously been dubbed 14th Gen and is launching in the second half of 2023. With Core Ultra and the next generation of regular Intel Core chips too, Intel is resetting and deprioritizing its generations. Core Ultra will run across desktops and laptop CPUs. You'll see i5, i7, i9 replacing with 5.7 night branding as seen in the aforementioned example. Intel Core chips will ditch i3, i5, i7 for 3.5.7. Intel says that UPH series branding will remain. As such, it remains unclear what the key differences will be between Intel Core and Intel Core Ultra chips, with Intel currently only stating that Core Ultra represents a pre brand and Core is a mainstream brand. Along with the removal of iBranding, the generation will no longer feature the start of the name, instead of the 14th gen Intel Core i9-14900H, as we would have expected to see with 14th generation Meteor Lake chips. If the branding had remained the same, you can expect to see chips along the lines of Intel Core Ultra 91900H. This is simply an example provided by Intel and not a confirmed product. This style is the new norm for Intel chips and will continue beyond Meteor Lake. According to Intel, this new branding is beginning at the launch of Intel Core Ultra processor to highlight a significant chip in architecture and design. To that end, these will be the first consumer chips from Intel to feature its dedicated AI engine Intel AI Boost. Meteor Lake is the first series of chips that are manufactured on the Intel 4 process node. Another confusing bit of branding from Intel that obscures the nanometer process of its processors. Intel 4 equates to a 7 nanometers process. A lower nanometer processor typically represents a significant boost in power. With this change in naming scheme, Intel is also updating its EVO branding. Devices that live up to the required EVO standards will now be referred to as Intel EVO Edition laptops, rather than simply donning an Intel EVO logo. So yes, from now on, every Intel consumer will be happy.